The Dragon and the Giant by Kendall Bruns. Once upon a time, there lived a king named King George. He had a problem. A dragon was attacking the castle. The dragon could breathe fire, fly, and smoke up the castle. The king couldn't take it anymore. He decided he'd be better off without a dragon to battle every day. He decided he'd better destroy this dragon. He sent out 20 knights in shining armor and 9 dragon catchers, because he didn't want to lose a lot of dragon catchers. When the knights and dragon catchers attacked the dragon, the king had lost again. He needed one more thing. But what? One day, a boy named Jonathan was walking in the woods, when all of a, all of the sudden, he heard a big crash. He looked around. He couldn't believe his eyes. It was a giant. Now, Jonathan was a smart boy. He knew the king was trying to destroy the dragon. He thought the giant might be of use. He ran as fast as he could to the castle and told the king. The king said, a giant? There isn't any such thing. The boy said, if you don't believe me, come and see for yourself. The king said, okay, but it will just be a waste of my time. So the king went with him. When they got to the woods, the king was startled. Did he really see a giant? He went up to the giant and said, excuse me, but would you please help me, Mr. Giant? The giant said, what did you say? The king said, excuse me, but would you please help me, Mr. Giant? The giant said, what do you need help with? The king said, a dragon is attacking my castle. So the giant came to the castle with the king and Jonathan. When they got to the castle, the dragon was attacking it. The king said, see, that dragon is attacking my castle. The giant went to the dragon and said, hey, dragon, let this castle alone. The dragon said, no. The giant said, you better. The dragon said, who's going to stop me? The giant said, I am. The dragon said, oh, yeah. The giant said, yeah. And I'm going to do it tomorrow at 12 o'clock. So the next day at 12 o'clock, the giant and the dragon were ready for the fight. The giant was given a 90-pound shield and a 70-pound sword. They were so big. The king rang a bell and the fight began. They fought sword to claw and shield to fire. The dragon even tried smoking up the giant. While they were fighting, the giant said, Why don't we just settle this fight and you can live with me? The dragon said, well, okay, but you better treat me right. The giant said, deal. The castle was saved, and they all lived happily ever after. The end.